welcome to another car fix video from Johnny Vlogger UK and today we are going to fit the brand new catalytic converter and front down pipe to a Volkswagen Golf Mark IV 2000 uh, 2 litre GTI and basically we've got the old one there next to it and as you can see someone cut it off so that the section from there to there is missing under the car so I took that bit out I've taken this off six nuts and the old gaskets down there that's the exhaust gasket so I've bought a brand new one nice shiny new one so we're going to fit that in and then I've bought an O2 sensor I've screwed that in there and then that will fit under the car inside this box there's a little box that goes just under there you can probably see the plugs, the plugs hanging there by the actual stand and the jet it all fits under there and then uh, Hopefully it'll be up and running. Right, so there's the exhaust there. We've got the exhaust here under the car. We've got to fit it through this hole. We've got to fit it through there. Fit it through there. This gap. And then bolt it to those six bolt threads. There's an O2 sensor fitted just above it. That's the pre cap. And then you've got your after cap. Goes after the cap and it'll link up. It'll link up with this brown plug. And that black one obviously is the front one. Alright, so let's get this exhaust in. Let me charge it ain't gonna go in, you know. I don't know why. This one's gonna give me grief. It's a funny angle, it's quite a steep angle this pipe. Unless you've got to put it in a certain way and spin it round. But I ain't got the room to do that, so I don't know how it's going to go in. I'm going to have to, uh, probably got to take that bracket out at the bottom to give me a bit more clearance. Okay, so I've tried pushing the, um, the exhaust through here, and it won't go through, so what I'm going to have to do is a bracket here. There's a bracket here with three 13mm nuts this side and there's a 10mm nut up there. I'm going to have to take this bracket off and it should give me a bit more clearance to get the exhaust through. So we'll undo this and then we'll try and get the exhaust through see if that works. <coughs> Okay, so we took that bracket off to give us more clearance and it's paid dividends. I've just wiggled and pushed the exhaust through the gap and it just goes through. So I've got the new gasket on the top there on the manifold, the inlet manifold, no, the outlet manifold and the exhaust is through now so I'm going to just start connecting it up now and then hopefully we're there ok so we push that exhaust through we've um, got the exhaust on now six bolts so it's got one more bolt to go up this left one it's a bit close to the um, exhaust so I can't get a socket on it so I'm going to have to use a spanner so once that's all done that's done. I've put the this 
power steering shield or exhaust shield, whatever it is, I've put it back on, it's set one bolt, there's a 10 mil bolt, it's got to go on the right hand side at the top, um, let's see it here, it's got to go right, it's just up there, right at the top, there's a little hole, just here, there, a bolt in there and then you've got you've got one two three thirteen mil bolts there the exhaust ones are seventeen mil to do up and then the exhaust it's going along there I've pushed it in the center pipe there's a bracket there there's a bolt missing, I've got, to, I've got to get a new bolt and that one there at the back of the bracket has been chopped off the other side so I've got to bang that out and get a couple of bolts there and then it's basically fit this oxygen sensor, the back one, to the brown plug the front one's all connected and then there's a little box, it goes in a housing up here connect that, tighten that up and then we're done Okay, so we fitted the new exhaust now. We put a couple of coach bolts in. M10, 50, 60 mil long. Got them in um, tool station. A pack of 10, there's only two quid for a pack of 10, so I've used two. Come with the bolts and the nuts. So I put them on there and uh, put some exhaust paste on the joins to seal the gaps because it was blowing a bit and then obviously the exhaust goes all along there and then up up to the uh, manifold I don't know if you can see probably can't see oh there, there you go you can see up there okay so there you go we got there in the end and the car's a lot quieter now so that's a step nearer to getting it road legal again. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to my channel. Johnny Vlogger UK. Okay, thanks a lot. Stay safe. Bye for now.